stage two. Uh, this is where the game starts getting a bit more intense. Also, a level where removed the home shots come very, very handy. As you can see here, just stay around the top of the screen and nothing will hit you at all. Well, now, in, now there's a section where there's lots of fairies who spawn lots of familiars. Want to try and reduce them so that you can get lots of time for them. So let, let the fairies spawn the familiars and then focus on shooting. I was a bit fast. Only got two familiars out of the last fairy. That's not very much. Anyway, time points in this level is hard if you don't know what to do. Otherwise, it's easy. It's the last part of the level is the most important. This, I do just don't bother and just attack everything. Now, for this part, you want to wait quite a while and then focus on the level. Look at my time points and see how fast they are Yeah. Now it's our mid-boss. Who's also the boss. Try and kill those familiars before they get to you. Well, the one that's in the middle. And big spell guard from our mid -box. Not, Not the very easy attack. Oh no, it's this one. It's a very, very easy attack. Sorry. Uh, I, I've only failed this once in my whole Toho career and not quite as good. And there's no second part of the stage. Mid boss goes straight into the boss. This is Mr. Lorelei. Uh, she's sort of inspired by the German, I think German legend of the Lorelei. Uh, basically, here her power, she's a sparrow. And uh, her, her special power is that. When she sings, uh, darkness arrives and we sort of become blind. She'll use that for her to last spell card. She's a not a too hard level 2 boss except for her last non-spell attack, which is just uh, very hard. Uh, generally, you want to try and destroy familiars in her attacks. Uh, we're like, we'll see just here, I think. Yeah. Like alternating between shots and the thing. Do that with the other monster. And try I like to destroy the videos coming away. Now for her first spell card. Not not very easy. Uh can use these points quite a lot. The shots coming out from Ninja herself are aimed at you and I just bombed because I was scared. That's how you're supposed to use bombs. Now for the most horrible non spell in this game, maybe. Destroy the familiars and hope that uh, the green shots don't completely ward you. I'm getting very lucky here, so I'm quite happy about that. I uh, didn't destroy enough familiars here, and I found so I was scared of the third one. I have no idea what happened, and I kept on. Yay! It, do it doesn't really matter. Last attack, destroy familiars. They make a distinct noise when they're spawned. So remember that, and they also make a distinct noise when they explode. You just really can't see anything now. It's really have to do that. And as you can see, even though I get bombed, I still have more than enough time points to get the uh, last. This attack is very cheap because you just can't see anything and you have to use insane reflectors to actually dodge stuff. And, uh, yeah. Last build are very easy. Okay, so that's our stage two. Now let's move on to stage three. Uh, we're arriving at the human village. Placed in Gensokyo, where humans can live safely, thanks to the boss which we're going to encounter now. This stage is hard, and I don't even have a bot for it. This is actually quite some bad news. Because uh, there's many several places where you really want to run. Not 
not sure how I'm going to do that. Especially the place which is coming very soon. Get at the bottom left of the screen and start screaming. Unfocus so that you can attack all the enemies. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Good. This is another part of the water part, which is uh, impossible with the magic. Ah! Thanks to uh, bad, bad, bad spread. Here's our mid boss. Destroy the familiars. Well, I'm saying that was Or something for the early boss in this game. Uh, one thing about the, this character is that the familiars shoot different kinds of shots depending on whether you're focused or unfocused. Usually you don't want to switch too much in the middle of the attack. Uh, so she thinks that we're trying to attack the human village and is hiding it from her. No, uh, from us, sorry. Uh, yeah, she has that kind of power. Anyway, she is going to be the boss of the game of the stage later on, so we'll talk about her later. First pyramid, or whatever this is called. Quite a fun attack. Not, not too hard, not too easy. Uh, this, this boss's difficulty is all around very well bad. Makes for a very good fight. And she drops an extra life like all stage 3 mid bosses do. So here we have all the time in the world to use the I really didn't take any risk here, I should have tried to get the point item. Oh. Now, now, yeah. One thing about this game is that it has a lot of fairies with huge amounts of HP. And the last fairy dropped a bomb. Nice. There we are. Uh, I'm going to do something different. And maybe some people are going to hate me for it, but I'm not going to pronounce her name like you're supposed to in Japanese. This person here is Kaino Kami Shirasawa. Uh, you would have to say Kene in Japanese, that sucks, so I'm pronouncing it the German way. Hey, two references to German already, wow. Uh, it's funny because she's a hist he she eats history somehow. That's how she hit the village, I think, too. And kind of saw is uh, the negative uh, pronoun, whatever, in, uh, in German, so somehow it makes sense. She also is a ha half beast who transforms uh, when there's a full moon. By the way, that's another proof that uh, the moon was replaced by a fake one. Never thought about that until now. Anyway, she thinks that we want to attack the human village, so she's attacking us. And uh, yeah, usual door stuff. There's actually no real reason to fight, but there we are. Uh, very, very, very good stage 3 boss. Very well balanced. Uh, for her non spells, you want to destroy the familiars. Because uh, they're the only thing to do. So it makes for some fun, unfocused dodging. Except if you're playing with your new or the ring, I guess. <laughs> First spell card, Ethel Morality 137. Destroy the familiars. Again. Uh, this, this, this attack is harder with Grimm because uh, of her weak unfocused shot. And there's a bit of dark in the bowl. And yeah, failed. And all headquarters price. Now, this is a memorization attack. I practiced this lots and lots and lots of times, and now it's easy. Man, was it hard to go. Second non spell, destroy the familiars. Don't worry, I'll stop saying that by the end of the game. By the end of the game, familiars have way, way, way too much HP. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Uh, Greek Treasures Country. This attack is annoying. You can't call it hard by any means, but I still die to it quite a lot because of those uh, weird mirroring. There we go. I'm not playing very well, am I? And another completely static attack. I play it a lot and you will eventually figure out just by playing the way to do it. That's how static attacks work. 
I never tried to actually memorize stuff for this, but I still did it. And um, we get our time point requirements, so we get to place the last bill. Uh, I think it's, this is like also is static, but it's way more excited than the other one, and I'm still doing quite well. Yes, uh, finally catch our last bill. Okay, doing. So I've lost one life for now. Or is it two? I think it's only one, so it's, it's alright. Oh, and she just told us who was uh, behind that abnormal room. Boom. Interesting. And now we're heading into the bamboo forest. <laughs>